It is being called an historic deal and the beginning of a new relationship between City Hall and the police union. Strong words that need to be backed up, but the new deal provided another pay increase for officers. And moves them into 12-hour shifts. 19 News anchor Brian Duffy met with Mayor Justin Bibb today to take a deeper dive into what all of this means, Duffy, moving forward. All right, uh, as we worked our way through this, I spent about a half hour with the mayor in his office this afternoon. A mediator involved in the process called it one of the finest examples of parties working together to resolve a difficult problem for the greater good. High praise, but now the deal must be put into practice and have the hoped for results. Mayor, I, I believe you said this is gonna help maximize services to mm -hmm. residents. How and why? Being able to fully staff our patrol cars across all five police districts will allow us to be more responsive to those priority one, priority two, priority three calls across the entire police department. The other thing I would also say is we've been losing way too many officers and I want to be fully staffed as quickly as we possibly can. And these new policies, these new investments, I believe are a positive step in the right direction to ensure we can be fully staffed over the next couple of years. Because when I talk to residents, they want more police, more investments in public safety, and that's what this initiative is all about. Is there a level of trust between the people of Cleveland and the police? And we know that that's always going to be a yeah. work in progress. Yeah. How do we make that better? If you would have asked me that question 10 years ago, I would have said we have a long way to go. Uh, but now, having been under, under the consent decree for almost a decade, you know, our department has changed dramatically. Um, the complaints against our officers have gone down. Uh, use of force incidents have gone down. And there's just a different tenor about policing in this city. Ha can we declare mission accomplished? Absolutely not. Uh, but I think the work that uh, Chief Drummond and Deputy Chief Todd and the command staff have led over the last several years since I took office have been an amazing foundation to make sure we have a, a better relationship with the community. And a critical piece to this, the mayor told me, is getting a handle on keeping violent people in jail instead of out on the streets committing crimes. He's planning to meet with prosecutors and those in the juvenile justice system to make this happen.